Isn't it beautiful? Darren's wife, Valerie, their two sons, Joel and Lane, and Darren's extended family got their first look at the block on the Crusade Walk of Fame, which honors a man who Valerie says always avoided being in the spotlight. You know, he wouldn't like this, Rachel. He wouldn't? He wouldn't. No, he wouldn't. He, wouldn't. he didn't like attention? No, he didn't. He was a very humble person, and it, this, it wouldn't have been about him. He would have made it about somebody else. Darren collected for the crusade from the time he was four years old. He collected while serving with his father, David, on the Leavenworth Fire Department. After leaving the fire service, Darren, Valerie, and all the Wilkins family continued collecting as the Leavenworth Crusaders, never once thinking they would one day need help from the crusade. The telling moment was at delivery when uh, Lane had complications. He wasn't breathing. The twins spent 63 days in the neonatal intensive care unit where Darren noticed all the life-saving machines were marked with crusade labels. After the twins recovered, Darren and Valerie decided to honor the doctors and nurses who helped Joel and Lane. They did that by placing bricks on the Crusade Walk of Fame. And on this day, the Wilkins family celebrated Darren's life with a tradition that he started just how proud we are of him and all that he did for the crusade and we appreciate all that you have done for for us too and bringing us here and for the block it's so kind of you to do and we really appreciate it thank you